guys welcome back to my channel okay today i want to share with you a product share i could say it was actually from scrapbook boutique the place that i purchased it from i absolutely love ordering from them the service is fantastic they ship the orders out really fast so no complaints there and i've known the owners of scrapbook boutique for quite a while now <laughs> Okay, so first of all, I got a 49th and Market, these beautiful flowers, and those flower, these flowers I used at the side of my book here when I created it. Hopefully it's not too, there you guys can see that. So I used these flowers on my little um, roller decks there, or oh, not little, but you know. So I did get two packets of those because I know I would use them. Now the other thing you can do is if you don't like these buds on the in the middle of them, you can peel them off and put you know other things in the middle of it. So they're really handy to have. I also got another two bottles of my art glitter glue, which I absolutely love. Um and I don't know why I got two of these. Like for some reason in my cart, I know um I don't know whether it was just me or whatever, but I ended up with two of the Snow Writers, which I've got no idea how that happened. And that was the case with a few things. So this is Create Dimensional Snow Effects. I have never used this before, so I can't tell you what it's like. But as soon as I do, I'll let you guys know. I also got some more of my basic grey magnets, the big size love these of course you need your new blades because i'll go through my blades like there's no tomorrow i get some i th actually thought i'd lost my tweezers so i finally found them <laughs> and i ended up with another pair so that's great because then i've got a backup i also purchased Oh, yeah, I did. Um, the sequin butterfly, uh, butterfly in the pale pink. And I'm hoping that the glare... Let me see. I'll open it up and then put it on a piece of cardstock. Huh. One that I preferably haven't used for... Oh, here we go. So you get three... Ooh. Three of these really really pretty there we go so I've got two packs of those I'm not keeping both the packs they are being gifted I got two packs of the red bows and these are so cute the reason why I got the red bows is I want to put them in my Christmas project so there's those really really pretty i've got sequins on there i've got the pink bows Ooh, sorry about the glue guys and i did get the silver and these are the four centimeter ones really really pretty okay so i won't take any more of those out uh let me see i did get the butterflies in the white now, I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but let's give it a go anyway. Ooh, I can get them out here. Oh, here we go. There we go. How pretty are they? So I did get those ones. And I won't get onto the paper lines just yet. I did get the Amy Design and what is that brocanti christmas i think it is so it's a pair of ice skates absolutely love those and there's some of the other dies from that collection as well and the code if i can find huh doesn't give you a code oh hold on a tick it's add10036 because that's the bottom ones there it's those ones 
I did get The Nature of Christmas, and that's by uh, Precious Mariki. Mariki? I'm oh, sorry, I don't want to butcher your name or anything. And that's kind of hard to read. So, oh, PM <laughs> 10103. And that's the Christmas uh, florals. Oh my gosh, seriously, I'm tongue twisted. Uh, what else did I get? I did get... Huh, I thought I had... No, I did get another die. That's all right. I got the Christmas corner. And that's uh, PM10100. And there's all the other ones that are behind it as well. Love these. I did get, and I'm so excited about, oh, I'll show you these ones first. Um, the Kaiser Craft, they're decorative dies, and this is the uh, the mini snowflakes. I didn't realize they were mini. And I thought they would have come in, you know, your separate dies, but look at the back of it. It's all one die, which I love. I mean, seriously, look at that. So all you need is that one <laughs> big die. That's good enough for me. As long as it cuts out those snowflakes, doesn't bother me. <laughs> okay, I also did get the decorative dies, and these are Kaiser Craft, and you get four pieces. Uh, layered baubles, and that's the back of them. Really, really pretty, so I can't wait to use those. I'm all about Christmas. I love Christmas. Now, I did, and I've been after these for, ugh, for ages. Um, good friend of mine, Jacqueline, and she's Meadowlark001 here on YouTube. And she uses a lot of Heartfelt Creations dies. And um, she uses these delicate borders. I think the basics, I think these are the ones that she used in our black and white mini page swap. And they are absolutely stunning. If they're not the right ones, she must have used different ones. But she used Heartfelt Creations nonetheless. So I wanted to get some of these dies. So these are my first lot of heartfelt creations dies and i'm super excited about them oh, okay so that's the back of them there absolutely beautiful and you see they're a generous size you know i really really love these so oh cannot wait to start using those i know i'll be using them in a project and this is fleur borders and pockets so sorry this one here is HCD1-7118 and that's Delicate Border Basics and then Fleur Borders and Pockets and that's HCD1-778 and there's six pieces in this one and there were six pieces in the other one and it's so pretty so this is what you get in the packet there I'm assuming that's what it is but I could be wrong. Huh. Doesn't look like that. One, two, three. Unless. No. Okay. Unless you buy the outline of it separately. Okay. I will have to look into that. And see how that works. Like I said, I haven't used the heartfelt ones before, so hmm, interesting. So you basically get these three, but the outline of it very interesting. Okay, so they just all right. Well, I'll figure it out and let you guys know. Oh, the next thing I did get, and I'm so excited about this. Oh my gosh. I got the case of craft, and this is Golden Grove. Really, really pretty. I thought it'd be something different, um, something fresh. Now I'm going to zoom out a little bit. And then that way I can show you guys. Sorry about the lighting. It's probably not as good as it really should be let me 
see if that's any better. Okay. So I've got two packs of the 12 by 12. Yes, two packs. And for some reason, the die cuts, I ended up with two packs as well. And I don't generally use two packs of die cuts. So that's the front of it here. And that's everything you get in there. So let me show you. Oh my gosh, how pretty. Now I just want to make sure you guys can see that. It kind of looks skew if there. There we go. I think that's better. How beautiful are these? Oh my gosh, the butterflies, the flowers. So you get two sheets and that's at the back of that one. Oh, sorry. Yeah, that one was actually called Gold Dahlia. And that's P2352. That's if you buy them individually. So then that way you know. Okay. Then we've got Greenery. And this is P2353. Really love that. I don't want to go up too high. I love it how it's got live, laugh, love. And you know what? You can cut the bottoms out and use those in your albums or cards or journals. Love that. Oh, I love this one. Collated. This is called. Oh, so pretty. And that's P2354. So get cut post, uh, postal, um, all the old vintage writing. Absolutely love this one. And then these are the days I want to remember, and all of them are with you. That's, so that's really nice. Okay, love it. This is canola. Kind of reminds me of the oil. <laughs> oh, sorry, the one previous to that. I'm not sure if I gave you the number. It's. Um, P2354, and that's collated. Okay, canola is P2355, and that's the back. True friends are the greatest of blessings, and I love that bottom strip there. Really, really pretty. Fallen leaves is the next one, and that's P2356. Really, really pretty. Love lots and live well. Beautiful. Love that. Soft moss is the next one. Oh, these are my papers there. And that's P2357. Okay, so that's that one. I love this. Oh, how gorgeous is this. When you love what you have, you have everything you need. Really, really pretty. Sorry, guys. You probably... Hopefully I'm not out of frame here. And this is the sticker sheet. Oh my gosh. Love this. Look at this. It's all one strip, but obviously you can cut it down into pieces as well. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So these are the die cards that come with it. So what I'm going to do is I'll just place them on my desk because it's white. So you guys will get an idea of how much is in here. Like I said, I have no idea why I had or why I would order two packets but you know sometimes we just add it in the cart okay so you kind of get an idea I've got to admit there is a lot of yellow colour here so you can break it up. Okay, that's those ones there. So I'll just put those to one side. And these are like full, um, you know, um, what do you call it? Leaves and stuff. Well, it kind of reminds me of full. Hmm. Considering we're heading into spring, it's still a bit of rough weather, but to come, I guess. Look, clock, just uh, 
guys. And I love this one. This one is so cute. Look at that. Love it. So that's the ephemera pack. Like I said, yeah, oh my gosh, you get so much in there. I have no idea why I um, ordered two packs. Beyond me. Alrighty. So then, oh, lordy, lordy, lordy. I'll put that to one side and then I'll fix it. Oh, they're everywhere. Then I'll fix it up afterwards. And I did get the six and a half by six and a half paper pad. Now I'll show you guys the inside of it. It is so, so pretty. If I move it up there, that should be better. Okay. And so you get two sheets of each. Now, I don't know. This has got more green leaves in it than what the 12 by 12 had. And I know sometimes in the 6x6 paper pads, you, you get different designs than what you would. I don't know. That almost looks like the same anyway. In the 12x12. Um, the 12 12. But these seem to be similar. So pretty much the same. Okay. So, so pretty. And two, like I said, two sheets of each love this one. Oh my gosh I love love this really really pretty oh no you do get different <laughs> this is gold um, gold writing on there gold foil writing really pretty this sheet here I should have maybe got two maybe that's what I was aiming for two of these small paper pads I accidentally clicked two of the die cuts oh and we've got the pears love this got these bits down here oh look at this how beautiful this is really pretty in person and i love this i wish they would have put a bit uh foil in the 12 by 12 that would look so pretty but look at these really pretty foil pieces there oh you only got one sheet of that one what oh no two sheets of that Woo. oh did i skip did i skip a few oh no <laughs> maybe i did oh i love this love that beautiful it's, <coughs> excuse me some of these i wish they would have made in a 12 by 12 that's really pretty oh no they did make that but that's in a sticker sheet this one here i'm pretty sure anyway so that's got foil on it and you'll get two sheets then you've got the die cuts out here as well absolutely love then you've got your borders along here and some of the little tags here as well really love it oh so so pretty so that's that one and I did get the keepsake collection again, another one. Oh, I know. Love this collection. So I will, I'm not sure if I sh had shown you guys this collection. Huh, did I or didn't I? Oh, well, you're going to see it again. <laughs> All right, so this is the card and you would have seen my keepsake album which i have got part of a tutorial done it's going to be done in two parts so i need to film the second part okay so this one's called captured and it's p2325 and that's probably a bit too high because i think i zoomed in yeah so let me there we go I love this one with the camera. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. And that's the back of it there. Then you've got the gallery and that's P2326. That's it there. Really, really pretty. And then you've got the wood grain. Life is like a camera. Focus on what's important and capture it perfectly. Love it. Uh, picturesque. And this is P2326. Uh, 327 love that and that's the back of it 
and collage and that's p2328 love that it's got a little almost oh my gosh this is my favorite part love this one then we've got collected and that's p2329 I probably shouldn't have it up so high. Capture life, capture smiles, capture love. Love that one. Photo montage. And that's P2330. That's the back of it. A picture is worth a thousand words, but the memories are priceless. And this is the die cuts. So... That's it there. Love it, love it, love it, love it. I also did get the ephemera pack. As well. So what I'm going to do is just lay them out on here so you guys can get an idea of what you get in there. It's pretty quick. Okay. You get so much goodness in here, like seriously. And these die cards can be used in your junk journals too. If you can't use them up in your mini albums, your layouts or whatever, use them in your junk journals. Great way of using them up. Okay. At the end of the at the end of the day, all that matters is love and memories. So make sure you give it and make sure you make them. Okay, so that's the ephemera pack. And then, that's it. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching. And stay tuned. The next video should be my, uh, let me see, uh, tutorial for the Keepsake album. Okay, take care. Bye.